Hi and welcome to this DCP Word tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download a high resolution Google Maps image. Okay, let's go ahead and open up the web browser and into Google search here, I'm going to type in Google My Maps. So you type in Google My Maps and you need a Google account in order to do this. And you click on Google My Maps here. And when you click on that, there'll be an option here to create a new map. So we're going to click that. And it says untitled map here. So I'm going to click here and just give it a name. Let's just say we're going to call this one Stratford map. Yeah? So Stratford is a location quite close to me. I'm going to click save. And then I'm going to go to the search bar here. I'm just going to type in Stratford E15. And I'm going to click on this pin right here, this or this option right here. And that's going to zoom in onto the map. So you just need to search for your relevant location. And this, this is Stratford here, right? So it's got all of the different areas around here. You've got the Olympic Park and Westfield Shopping Centre. So if you're visiting London, then I suggest that you might want to come and visit Stratford. It's got a nice shopping centre and a nice park here, right? And the big Olympic Stadium. Anyway, let's click on these three little dots here, right here, and we're going to go to Print Map. And when we click on Print Map, it's going to give us some options. And we're going to click on the drop down and we're going to select A3, which is going to be the largest size available, right? A3. So that's double the size of A2, basically. I'm going to set it to landscape, but you can leave it at portrait, but I prefer landscape. And I'm going to click on image here. And then I'm going to click the print button. It's going to open up a new tab. And it's going to off, ask me to print this document, right? It wants me to print it, but I'm going to click cancel. And I can see the image in the background here. So let's just um, drag this to the side. And you can right click on this and save image as. But I'm just going to take the image and drag and drop it to my desktop. I'm going to minimize this now. And open up this image and you can see that it's quite high resolution right when we're zooming in it's not pixelating so we've got a nice high resolution image that we can work with if you wanted to add that to some sort of um you know online work or some pdf or something like that if you needed a nice map this is a nice way to get hold of a good map and you can create your own little custom pin inside of um photoshop or something like that to pin some specific location right you can zoom into here you can crop out the map for a certain section as well but the idea is to get a nice high res image that you can put into your print work or your download document work or on your website or wherever you want to put this particular map if you're going to put it onto your website you'd probably be better off just embedding the um, google maps directly into your website right but if you just want a nice high res image that you want to use in some print work then maybe this is a better option for you so let's close this down we'll drag this image into this folder that's the end of this tutorial don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel i've got over 600 videos on different subject areas the all tutorial is based on software and learning so my idea of this channel is to help you learn so if you want to learn about 3d animation i've got stuff there if you want to learn about graphic design i've got some web development tutorials lots of different subjects on lots of different um, software applications so that's the end of this tutorial. I hope you find it useful and I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.